Hello and welcome back to the rainy weather of uh, New Vegas, my wasteland. Where is the mine? Loyal detonator. Oh. So how do I use it? Is it under here somewhere? Like detonator? Or is it under A? Like detonator? How do I use the detonator? This weather there. This weather. But there it is. Yep. Nice. So, who are the enemies over there? Looks like more bugs. I don't have time for these bugs. Let's just get out of this rain. And let's not get soaking wet. And let's instead get rewarded for helping the good people of Nellis. Though there is still the problem of needing to level up before we can tell... The other person about things. Time to find Loyal. Loyal. Where are you, Loyal? Oh, we can check our stuff together here. Nice. It's going to be a dream come true once you've raised that bomber from Lake Mead. You mean like now? That's tremendous. I'll transmit instructions to the robots to start packing up the plane to bring it back to Nellis. How exactly do you plan to get the plane back here? I just told you. The robots are going to handle it. They'll break the plane down into pieces and move it up from Colville Bay in one shot. Are you planning to use the versionary tactics to draw their attention? Exactly. We'll be shelling an unoccupied location in outer Vegas to get their attention elsewhere. By the time they realize they aren't under attack, the plane and the bots will be long gone. The kids wish we were shelling a real target, but Pearl thinks it's wise not to start up a war just as the lady has risen. Okay, well, I'm glad to have helped. Hey, I'd better get rolling. Jack and I have a lot of work ahead of us. Hello. Hello. Right then. Time to go talk to Pearl again, and... How far are we from leveling up? Because the problem is... I want to put 20 points in medical, don't I? I think I do. Hey, didn't I... Oh, that's a misc. Uh, quests, quests, quests. Uh, I guess... Guess I can worry about it later. Actually, I did mean to check stats. And I am really close to leveling up. Talking to Pearl should get me just that result. It should mean being able to fix this armor up by myself. Yes. Using the bright robes. Hello. Hello, friend. How can Mother Pearl be of help today? I've spoken to Loyal. The B-29 is on the way. What you have done for us is a miracle, child. You have fulfilled the only dreams we ever had outside our walls. You are a trusted friend of us all. If there is ever a way for us to help you, child, tell me. And I will make it so. Uh, there may be a battle in the near future at the Hoover Dam. Can you offer any assistance? Of course, my child. After all that you have done for us, we would love to help you in the upcoming battle. After all the training and virtual reality, the young ones would relish an opportunity to put their skills to battle. We'll be there when you need us. Excellent. Bye. Ooh, nice. Renowned for goodwill and all that sh jazz. Uh, if I could put that to 75 though, I'll only have two skill points left. No. This will have to wait. We'll go with medicine instead. Get medicine to 60 so we can save the last two patients. 
which isn't really all that relevant to anything, but you know. We like helping people, don't we? Yes, we do. Continue. Now I need... Where is it? I know exactly what I want. And I don't know what it is. So... <laughs> really? Um... 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 It surely it should be somewhere here. No? Let me just look again. Oh, sadly, sadly, I need to readjust my plans because I forget that this needed 90 repair, which we will do now. Where was it? Jury rigging. Done. This is a very valuable ability. Because <laughs> I can just take this and use whatever on it. And let's take Brotherhood robes. Yeah. The only issue with it is I might accidentally use something that I don't want to use. But I think we can avoid that fit for now. Lots of explosions going on. Oh, right. Um, since we did get some of the medical skill I needed for this, we can still go and save one of the patients. They don't all need to dead. This man's leg is seriously injured. It may require protection to save him. Are you sure you want to attempt the operation? Yes. Upon further examination, after cleaning the leg, you really realize it can be saved. You carefully remove the existing stitches, clean the wounds thoroughly, then restitch the wounds closed using a much more effective procedure. I thought that man was done for, but you brought him around. Oh, so we didn't have to cut off the leg. Oh right, I've seen a screenshot of that, I think. If you don't have the medical skill, you just uh, amputate the wrong leg and the man dies of shock. Right. Good plan. Uh, luckily, we actually realized we would have done more bad than good when we did that attempt previously. Where? In what direction is honest arts anyway? And how much goods are we carrying? Hmm, quite a bit of goods is what we're carrying. I should stop just checking it every two seconds. Let's go and... Those the gun runners maybe? There should still be plenty of cash here. Welcome, sir Yes, yes, or yes. Uh, let's see what you have. I am ready to process our transaction. So am I. Alright, I'll take these caps and I'll... Go put the thump thump in my room room. So that should help. Yeah. I think it's the North Passage that goes to the Hana Starts content. But I'm not Thank sure. You for new things. I probably have a quest for this. Let's see. Happy Trails Expedition. Midnight showing at the hard driving. Canyon Wreckage. Mm, that's that's not the one I want. I think it's the Happy Trails Expedition that it goes. In the wrong direction of where we want to go. Probably. Could also stop by the NCR base while we're actually in the area because that should help. Go. Victor, take me to my room. Where to, partner? My room. My room. Room, room, my room. Yes. That was so unnecessary. I'm not even disappointed in myself. Now, where's Tum Tum? Tum Tum, where are you? Get in here, Tum Tum. Tum Tum. Good Tum Tum. Also, we have a wardrobe. I could drop some of that stuff there, I guess. Like a beret, and a flight suit, and a helmet. And we could keep one of the robes. And Jessup's bandana. And Sheriff's duster. Wait, so our gambler hat was also unique, wasn't it? Stick it in there. 
And that should be enough. Yes. Right. Um, how much am I carrying? I guess that will do. We're carrying an extra hundred weapons. High roller, now. sweet. Yes. Take me back to the casino. So we can head casino out floor. and take the railway, I guess. I'm quite sure I wasn't aware of the railroad's existence the last time I even played. I heard of it. I knew I had to disable a bomb on it, but then I didn't. I wasn't able to find the place. It's just really weird. Um, who am I supposed to return to Ambassador Quokka? He might still be in the embassy though. Let's go to the embassy then. Oh. Yes. To the embassy. Which is that way. Opposite of 421. Yeah. Where are the speakers out here? Seems to be plenty of them there. Hello, Metropolis. Right. Don't try to use the garage door this time because the garage door doesn't actually exist in this. Despite our many attempts to find it, in finding it and such. Broker! Yo! Greetings, friend. Something I can help you with? Tell me about yourself, Ambassador. Interested in politics, huh? Well, grab a seat and get comfortable. I've been in politics quite a while now. Always had the drive to do it, even when I was young. It's just something I was drawn to. I started my career over 20 years ago, back in the NCR as the local mayor, and worked my way up from there. I managed President Kimball's first run for a seat on the council. I suppose that's why I have this ambassadorship. Interesting, uh, go on. I was elected to this post seven years ago. I'm the third NCR representative to serve here in Vegas. Now, I've had my share of ups and downs along the way, but I wouldn't trade it for anything in the world. That's it. Anything else you wish to know? Uh, what's happening around the strip? It's the same old stuff around here. Gambling, debauchery, drunkenness. It's all here. I'm getting a little old for it, however. If you want more information, try talking to some of the other guys around here. I don't get out of the office much anymore. Right, well, let's talk about the boomers instead. I hope you've returned with good news. Are they willing to help the NCR? Uh, the boomers have agreed to help me. Excellent work. I can't tell you how useful that would be. In any event, I have another assignment ready and waiting for you. But we can speak of it later. Rest up, and when you're ready, speak to me again. Yay, the NCR doesn't take me. I guess we could talk more. What is your other task? It's good to have a friend of the NCR here. What can I do for you? Earlier you mentioned another assignment. So I did. As you may have noticed, our position here in New Vegas is tenuous. We've made great strides, sure, but the NCR is not welcome here. Merely tolerated. And even then, not by everyone. We've had reports of violence against NCR citizens in a neighborhood just to the northeast called Freeside. Ever been there? Hmm. Yes, what of it? Violence is something of a way of life there, but there's been a disturbing rise in the number of attacks on our people lately. More worrying is the fact that our sources suggest the violence is being perpetrated by the gang that runs the place, the Kings. I need someone to look into this that won't attract attention. Would you be interested? Sure, I'll look into it. Good. Our men have come up with two different plans for seeing an end to the violence. First, our sources have tracked most of the attacks back to a king named Pacer. The consensus is that the violence will stop if he's removed. The problem is we can't simply kill him. In the current climate, the NCR would likely be blamed for his death. There is an alternative option, but my sources feel that getting rid of this Pacer fellow is our best shot. What's my other choice? I'm not a violent man myself, so I had our guys come up with an alternate solution on the off chance that our agent-to-be shared my sentiments. In that case, we could take a different tact, but one that I at least have more experience with, diplomacy. If we can't go after the man responsible, we'll simply appeal to the man above him. 
The Kings, including our friend Pacer, report to the leader of their gang, the man who calls himself the King. Then more about the King. He's Caucasian, in his mid-30s, and extremely charismatic. It's that last part we're counting on. The Kings are a bunch of young hoodlums who aren't inclined to listen to anyone except him. Get him on your side, and the rest will fall in line. Uh, what will they need to do? Go and talk to the king. Try to convince him to put an end to this violence. Pacer's a punk, but he won't likely disobey a direct order. The king might not be open to the idea at first, so you may have to integrate yourself with him. Do whatever it takes. When it's done, one way or the other, report back here and we'll take it from there. Guess I'll go have a talk with the king then. I wish you luck. If you run into some difficulty and think you'd rather just take the shot with Pacer, that's fine too. Uh, also, despite being an extremely charismatic man, the king has a charisma of three, if I remember correctly. Hello. So charisma is actually his stump stat. Kind of curious, I suppose. But whatever works for him, right? Yeah. And then we run. To the area with the music. And then to the free side. So I suppose on a starts we'll wait for a little bit. Though not for very long there. Maybe a week or two at most. Yeah. So that area sounds like something that will take me more than a week or two at most. Which may be curious. We'll see. Hey King's Gang member, how are you doing? Hey there. Well enough I guess, then. It wasn't mean to me or anything. Just saying hey, hey. That's nice. I need to steal some hats. Eat this. Sadly, he doesn't look like he has a hat. Oh well. Help and keep the streets clean, right, Kings? Yeah. Into the King's School of Impersonation. Nice. Hey. That's space. Uh, that's a door that requires a key. That's not the spatula. That really reminded me of a spatula for some reason. Ooh, and here we have some beer bong. Wait, 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 wait. Which one was the key? This one. Oh, that didn't work. Here's a mole rat rug. That doesn't look very nice, does it? No. Where is the king? Are you the king? No, you're a bottle of wine. And that's one way to do it on the table, eh? <laughs> it's all guys here, though. Eh, I don't charge. Let's see. Cherry bomb. Are you familiar with that song? So I can't try to replicate it for the choke of a cherry bomb. How oh, sad that may be. Personal space meaning anything to you, guy? Not really. Should it? Oh, nice. Hey man, what are you up to? Bye. Hello, game croupy. The king is all that his name implies. And then some. Nice. Ooh, that's a nice bed. And I'm allowed to sleep in it. Nice. I cannot jump on it there. Oh, wait, wait, I can. Yeah. Ooh, look at the height of this room. It is balls. Balls for days. And jukeboxes and everything. It's not bad, is it? Mm. 
But then there's the laundry room. Nice. Uh, no actually actual laundry. Machinery thingies. At least they have a room for it. Alright. That's a switch plates. Nice. Yeah. Not a lot of tables because this was a school of impersonation. I'm gonna jump on this table, you don't mind the nail. Not at all. So the king is not here either. Guess he must be on a lower floor. I'll just keep on looking. Yeah. Hello. Yeah. Not in the toilets. Not on a throne. The that kind of is where you would exp to expect to find the king, isn't it? On a throne. A porcelain throne. No. I suppose not. No, not really anyway. That door might help. Zerjo. Hello. You want your hair done too? No, no, no. The kings are many. And their hair must be perfect. Okay, sorry. Faction goals. Keep the hair nice. Yo, Basie, you know where the king is? What do we have here? Another petitioner for the king? Yes, I'd like to see the king if possible. Anything's possible, I suppose. How much is it worth to you to meet the big man? I'm new in town and wanted to pay my respects. You know what? I like you. Half the people around here, they forget who runs this place. Head on through. The king's the bored looking guy by the stage. Can't fucking miss him. Nice. Hi. Hi. <gasps> Rex! Hi! What's up with your brain? Is it damaged? No. That's the king. And that's the king's gang member. Well. I think it's only appropriate we sit down and have a talk. Look, Rexy, someone new's come to see us. Poor boy. He hasn't been feeling well lately. I'm the king. What can I do for you? Uh, I needed to stop the violence against the NCR citizens in Freeside. So, I'm supposed to just start giving in to the demands of random strangers that come in here, huh? I don't think so. You want something from me? You're gonna have to earn it. It just so happens that I got a few things I need taken care of. So, what do you say? Sure. I'll start you off with something easy. Did you notice the bodyguards for hire near the gates when you entered Freeside? Yes. It's good money if you can stay alive long enough. Freeside's not as safe as it used to be, so the money is well earned. Usually well earned, that is. Recently my man tell me that one of those bodyguards, a fella named Oris, is making a little too much money. He's making a killing in repeat business. Once someone hires him, they never want anyone else. I want you to find out why. Specifically, I want you to hire him. Play the part of an innocent tourist and follow his lead. If nothing happens, so be it. But I'm guessing things won't go so smoothly. Call it a hunch. So, what do you say? Let's do this. Okay then. Once you part ways, return here. I'll look forward to hearing your report. Oh. And take this to cover the hiring cost. Thank you for the money. Right then. I think it's time to There's call the end of the episode, sir. Going into the lucky 38 to talk to Mr. House. That's bullshit. Everyone knows Mr. House doesn't talk to anyone. Indeed. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Check it out. Between the dumpsters there. Friend of yours? Nah, just some idiot that wandered down the wrong alley. Sound familiar? Hey! Yay, we get the fight!